How's it going everybody? Welcome back to YouTube News. First things first, before we get into the video, yes, in the background, you're not seeing my cats for once. This is, of course, as you can tell, a very cute baby raccoon. Uh, the other day, the dog was barking really loud, and I went outside to see what was the matter, and she had a baby raccoon cornered. The raccoon was very scared, so we grabbed the dog and put her inside, and the chilled with the raccoon for a while and I decided to film it for specifically for you guys for the YouTube channel so that was really cool uh, she eventually found her mother so everything's everything's good with her she's gone but uh, I do have some footage and I have more you'll see you know I'll, I'll put I'll put it in every once in a while but anyways this video is about Jesse Jesse finally uploaded the video he's been teasing us about for literally like weeks now it's called a window into my life if you haven't watched it uh, definitely go check it out link will be in the description basically what happens is it starts off just showing him you know in his apartment he's on his, he's on his laptop and something and, and stuff and someone's filming him and and um they keep following him around and everything eventually he notices them and he's you know always trying he's running away trying to get away from them and all this stuff but they keep coming back and you know he turns a corner they're right there you know he's, they're always there and everything and it turns out in the end that he himself was the one with the camera filming himself, kind of. So, that was the video. I wanted to make a... I wanted to talk about my thoughts and feelings on it and what it really means. Because he said, you know, there's hidden messages. It's totally different. And it was. It was totally different than a normal vlog or anything like that. I watched Scarce's video and he talked about it. And he said he feels like it means, like, he doesn't like doing daily vlogs. And it's really hard to get away with. And he, he just... He can't do it every single day. But my personal take on it, kind of, is sort of like that. But what I think with the camera and everything following him around and he can't get away from it is people online, like people always talking about him and, and stuff like that. Like a channel like mine, uh, news, you know, news channels and stuff like that, people talking about him and he can't get away from it, you know, no matter what, you know, he goes on the internet, looks up his name and there's people talk about him and commenting on his Instagram and all that stuff and he's trying to get away from that. He doesn't like it and, and such, but it turns out that he's the one filming him. So what he's saying is, what I think he means is that you know, it's because of him that all this stuff is going on. He was the one who chose to put himself online and everything. And he got super, super successful. And that, so he is the one who's doing it to himself. That's how I personally feel. I think it was a really cool video. I liked this kind of style of video. I hope he does more things like this. I mean, you know, with drone footage and stuff. And it, it was really, really cool. So glad to see Jesse back. Maybe it's good that he's not daily vlogging. He's just doing his thing, but he's going to be doing more things. He's, he recently stated that he would be um, making more videos for his downrange gaming YouTube channel, which has over a million subscribers. If you guys didn't know, he was recently at an E3 event where they revealed the new Battlefield, Battlefield 1. And a side note, uh, that looks really, really good. I played, you know, a decent amount of video games, I guess you could say. I really like the shooter genre. I'm getting, to be honest, call, tired of Call of Duty. I'm definitely going to be playing Battlefield 1 when it comes out, but that's that's a whole other topic. But, yeah, it's good to see Jesse making videos. I like the video. That's what my thoughts on it. It's like he's trying to get away from people talking about him online and stuff, and but it, he knows that it, it was because of him. He's doing it himself. Let me know. Do you agree with me? Do you think that's what he's talking about? Is it something completely different? I really want to know what everyone thinks of this and... I will be reading all the comments. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, watching and listening. Uh, you guys are amazing. Thanks for the new subscribe or the new followers on Twitter. If you're not following me, do it right now, please. We're gonna do a giveaway at a thousand followers. I know it might take a while, but the quicker we get there, the quicker I can do something awesome for you guys. Thank you so much. Leave a like. Tell me what you think in the comments. Like I just said, I hope you liked the baby raccoon. Like I said, I have more footage. Um, that's about it. Help me think of an outro.